Hi, my name is Amy Lynch Colflat. I'm the Zebra Real Estate Agent powered by Wazell Properties. And let me tell you, we have got the biggest treat. We are at 8035 Glen Forest Cove in the historic Glenbrook neighborhood. You can tell she is letting you know what's inside with this gorgeous curved wall of leaded glass and flagstone. Let's go see all the mid-century modern details. Stepping into this gorgeous time capsule of a house, we have an intimate feel with the drop ceiling right here and this flagstone is gorgeous. And this wallpaper, it's gone back to how the original owners had it. Now the carpet in this sunken, rotunda, round living room has wind wall wings on either side and the flagstone fireplace is see-through to the other side and has never been used. Now the furniture in this property is also quite negotiable because this piece is original to the home, yet refinished. Velvet tuck and roll and baby blue. So the carpet in here has all been redone all the way going up past the cast iron to the beautiful dining, more leaded glass, and the mid-century modern touches and detailings from the crown molding all the way down to the edgings underneath the steps. So stepping from the rotunda, you step up into the poured in place terrazzo floor and it is in mint condition. It has been freshly redone as is all of the rest of the finishes. So there's gas, has been included. There's now PEX in this house. The sewer underneath has been done and the foundation has been addressed and the roof is only a few years old. The vintage, vintage, vintage. I love that the little sink right here has its cover. The shutters for the bar area going out for entertaining and the classic mid-mod turquoise. And you even have all the little tricks in secret compartments that happen in beautiful mid-century buildings. I love that even in this little breakfast nook, there's the built-in, and right over here, there's a little half bath, and the laundry room as big as my first kitchen. There's a two-car garage with a covered carport, and look at how cool these bricks are. This triangle desk right here, also built in and straight through. There's so much flagstone in this building. There is a prayer nook. Some people today call it an art niche. And then right here is the air return has been built into the wall, yet still hidden by the flagstone. You've got pieces to hang your artwork. The piano can stay more poured in place terrazzo in absolute mint condition and you've got this beautiful desk with a chunky lucite so there's pocket doors everywhere everywhere and these wood floors were recently reinstalled and put in again there is a large closet on this side and another large closet on this side this gorgeous real wood paneled walls because Montebano Lumber built it, has a big enough closet. It could be its own little office space. I would make that my computer room. Across the hall, we are stepping back into time. Look at this amazing flagstone in here as well. And again, with a chunky, chunky lucite. And this is that vintage dusty rose bathroom. And most of these little bathrooms, the showers are so claustrophobic. This one's not, it even has a little tub so you could sit and shake your legs. <laughs> Every single original detail from the light fixtures to this stone, to the lucite, to the louvered drawers that are just so clean. This place is absolutely on point. This is the plainest room in the house. It's just a bedroom. It's a nice small room right off of the uh, hall bath, but now we are in the primary. There's three closets. We start with a cedar closet, then we have a very large closet. The room is amazing with this detailing, the wood detailing, and all the wood floors have been redone so that they're gorgeous, and this sink has the Greek key design 
and again and the fixtures and the white marble and another beautiful, beautiful closet. But you think, where's the restroom? That's not the bathroom. This is the bathroom. And here, again, with more flagstone fireplaces, this turquoise, this is a kiddie pool. This is so big. It is a massive bathtub. And the shower is right there and another sink. This is just gorgeous. Make it a part of your family's history because this little bit of history won't stay on the market long. I'm Amy Lynch Colflat and I look forward to showing it to you in person soon.